Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's Peter and Bane here. We are about to go on a little tracking exercise. Bane, wait. We're about to go on a little tracking exercise this morning. Um, Bane is full of energy and ready to get out. We have sent uh, one of our anti-poaching guards out to lay a track for us. Um, we will be looking at about a three kilometer track and I will update you and let you know how it went with Bane and um, how, how he's doing. Cheers. Well, there you have it. Um, our track is done. Um, you can see that both Bane and myself have, have worked up a sweat. Um, it went very well. Um, it was a little bit of a challenge. One of our rangers is on leave. Uh, normally we're a two-man team, one checking visual spur to confirm that we, that we are constantly on the right track and the other one is handling the dog. Um, so it was just me alone today, um, which was a bit of a challenge, but it actually went very, very well. Um, Bane did an a, a excellent job and really uh, made life very easy. Um, so yeah, we lost GPS signal. So we're not 100% sure of exactly how long the, the track was, um, but it, it, it definitely was at least three kilometers. So that, that's actually a very, good, a very good distance for where Bane is at at the moment. Um, yeah, so I just want to take a moment here to, to just speak about what Bane actually means to us here in the, in the bush. Um, you know, the, his job really does start without him even being deployed in the field. The, the deterrent factor of him being here has, has made such a big difference. The, the local community is, is uh, all talking about this mythical dog that, that can track anybody down and, um, you know, really do some damage when he finds them. Um, even though Bain hasn't actually, um, you know, bitten anybody, the, the, the rumors are spreading that, that uh, he, he, he really can, he can take down any man, doesn't matter how, how big. So that deterrent factor has really, has really helped us a lot. Um, we've seen an attitude change around the, 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 the community about, about um, the area and, and, and the, the poaching and really there, there is, is definitely stories going about and, and we want that to happen. We want those stories to reach the, the poachers. Um, next, you know, if you take a look at the bush at the moment, the grass is, is pretty thick. Uh, the bush is pretty thick. So it's very difficult for us to track in these conditions. And this is where Bane actually thrives. So without Bane, this track that we did this morning would have taken us hours to actually find the visual spur in between the long grasses. Um, and Bane just thrives through that because the, 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 the track layer actually lose, leaves so much scent on the grasses and rubbing up against the grass and the trees and the foliage. So at the time where we struggle the most, this is where Bane thrives. And that really is a, a, another big help for us. And obviously, in a real life uh, poaching scenario, um, you know, it, it, he, he's invaluable. You, you actually can't um, describe what he can do, not only with the tracking, but also um, for the safety of our team. Um, having a, a dog that's, that's trained in bite work really means so much. And it also gives our guys a lot of confidence walking around in the felt. You know, they've, they've really bonded with Bane. Um, he, they let, take care of him and he takes care of them, you know, that it really is such a well-formed team. So from myself here and Ben um, out in the bush in Africa doing what we need to do, we just wanted to say a big thanks to everybody who's contributing um, to Dogs for Wildlife. I know that not everybody can be out here in the front line and not everybody can be out in the bush the whole day, but you guys are making such a big difference to us and, and uh, such a big difference to our wildlife. Um, and then we'd also just like to thank Jackie and Darren and the whole Dogs for Wildlife team. Um, we can't express our gratitude enough and we can't tell you what it actually means to us. So there you go, Bane. Say goodbye and we'll be, be seeing you guys soon. Cheers.